How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Open Mango, and today we're going to be opening up some Pokemon and some Dragon Ball Super uh, Card Game Masters packs. Uh, we have the Professor Juniper Premium Tournament Collection box here, uh, and then we have, let's see, we have eight packs of Beyond Generations, the latest set from Masters, uh, and then Wild Resurgence. Uh, I cracked open a booster box of each of these. Um, the Wild Resurgence was a while ago. And like that update video uh and then uh yeah just cracked a new box and just pulled these packs out of there so i think we'll we'll dive into those uh, and sorry if you hear like other noise it's my dog uh she's just going bonkers in my office uh which is where i'm set up yeah i hope y'all are doing well having a great night great day wherever y'all are uh got gohan here in the back for some good luck hopefully we can pull an scr or a god rare uh, or some alt arts because uh, I just got the itch to open up some some sword and shield packs because uh, it's kind of crazy what's going on in the Pokemon market as well right now with uh, with the like alt art craze right now and then like sword and shield booster packs or booster boxes going like crazy expensive uh, it's pretty interesting and uh, so I was like you know what I, I got this tournament collection box for like I don't know I think like 28 30 bucks so um yeah if y'all are hearing that chewing it's it's my dog uh but yeah you get eight packs or seven packs uh but you do get three brilliant stars two fusion strike one evolving skies and a chilling rain um i'm gonna see i'm gonna pause real quick while i see what's going on with uh, the little pupper all right, we're back. But yeah, I, I really wanted to get into some packs. So I think we'll start with, you know what? We'll start with the Wild Resurgence uh, and then work our way into Pokemon because let's see if we can pull a God Rare out of Wild Resurgence. I mean, we've, Wild Resurgence has been really good to us. Uh, like three secret rares and all the same one. Uh, we have Baby Parasitic Premonition. Sun Goku Full Power and Full Blast. We have Super Saiyan Trunks, Baby. We have Ox King, Master Roshi, Toa, Universal Tuffalization Plan. Love saying that. Uh, we have Master Roshi, Krillin, a nice Sun Goku trial run. And hey, right off the bat, we have an SR, Garlic Jr. Looks dope. in the back yeah we opened 12 packs of these uh and these are four additional packs from that same booster box uh yeah i was really trying to decide what i wanted to open i was like i don't want to do another um what is it uh, beyond generations booster box kind of wanted to mix it up because i really wanted to open up some pokemon too so i was like you know what why don't we open up some uh pokemon and dragon ball and i just had to crack open uh <laughs> booster box to get some of the packs Oh, we have a Sorbet. Love this. I think it's a Zeke extra card, right? So it's an uncommon, but that art with the foiling just looks really good to me. And we have a Power Pole Goku. Yeah, let me know. Uh, I think Tim's Corner, um, y'all pulled the Goku God Rare, which looks dope. Uh, I really want to pull that just because um, I think it's a very fantastic looking card and kind of like a tribute to uh, uh, Kira Toriyama Sensei, you know, it'd just be really cool to pull that card. I think, uh, I don't know, I might try to do like a little chase if I can find like a good deal in a case. We have Shroom, Violent Majin Assault, and Mira, Creator Absorption is our rare. Last pack of Wild Resurgence. But I wouldn't be upset if we pulled a God Rare Super Saiyan 3 Goku out of Beyond Generations either. Don't get me wrong. Uh, we have Oop, Hercule, Frieza, Dr. Mew, Cell Larva, Bulma, Hercule, Vegeta, Garlic Jr., Sun Goten. Nice looking Goku again. And hey, there we go. There's my boy. Put you in the back for some luck. All right, not bad. We got one SR out of four packs, which is about a, about ratio. Since the packs came in this order, let's go ahead and just open it in that order. St 
still have not pulled any alt arts from Brilliant Stars. But then again, I haven't opened much Brilliant Stars. I think I may have opened up like 40 packs total. So can't expect to pull alt arts out of 40 packs. All right, there you go. There's your code. I can knock the camera there. Four from the back. We have Steel Energy or Metal Energy, Collapse Stadium, Luxio, Hot Helmet, <laughs> Cub Chew, my little cub back there, just running, Snow Runt, Team Yell Grunt, or Yell's Cheer, and then Breloom, regular rare, next pack. And if y'all have pets, I'm sure y'all can understand. All right. So I don't know if this means a hit, but we shall see. One, two, three, four. Let's go. We have a Psychic Energy. We have a Pot Helmet, Sigalith, Acerola, Bu Buizel, Halucha, Bidoof, Clefairy, Cherubi, and... Oh, nice! Got a full art berry. Nice full art to pull. Put you right over there. Last pack of Brilliant Stars. Wow. Out of two packs. Pulling a... Oh, there you go, there's your code. Pulling a full art. Dope. All right, we have Fire Energy, Rimplup, Charon's Care, Baratic, Bidoof, Clefairy, Grimer, Execute, Farfetched, Haxorus, and a Motham. Not bad. For three packs pulling a full art, I'll take it. Uh, yeah, I just uh, watched PokeRev's video uh, on uh, Fusion Strike. Hey, apparently the box prices are... <laughs> Like it's almost $240 right now, like on TCG Player, which is crazy because nobody wanted this set. Like, I remember like a year and a half ago, I think, uh, like boxes were still going for like, what, like $80, $90? It's just crazy. Uh, we have a Lightning Energy, Dancer, Pangoro, Grapple Lock, Shroomish, Clefki, Trubbish, Totodile, Rever uh, reverse hold it out and a phantom behind there. And we have an Oracorio Fusion Strike. Next pack of Fusion Strike. We have four from the back. We have Fighting Energy, a Halucha. We have Lapras. Schoolboy, Caterpie, Drillver, Shinx, Benary, Basculin. We have a Grand Bull Reverse. I think that's a rare. It is a rare. And a Evil Tall or a Yvel Tall. All right. Evolving Skies and box prices on. Don't even get me started on this. Like, holy crap. If y'all were around for the craziness. Oh, well, it looks like we're not going to have nothing in that pack, so we'll just kind of run through it. That is a nice Pikachu art, though. Uh, Kitty Fly, Eevee. Also love that art with the Rayquaza in the back. Looks tight. We have Psyduck, Tompole, Woobat, and Flapple. Oh, also that Vigoroth art. It's pretty dope. Uh, yeah, if y'all were around when <laughs> the Evolving Skies craze happened, especially with like the Pokemon Center exclusive ETDs, let me know. Um, uh, man, I was lucky enough to scoop just one of them up and it was like the least, not Leafeon, uh, the Vaporeon, Glaceon one, I think. All right, cool. Chilling Rain. Let's see if we can pull that Blaziken Altar or which one would I want to pull? The Zara Aura. Honestly, that one looks sick. We have a... Clara, Haunt Haunt, Doctor, also watch a lot of Doctor Who, stop for a bit, need to, need to go back to it, we have a Ladybug, Zarude, and a Malamar, yikes, 
All right, well, not bad. I mean, all right, now that was pretty bad. Like for seven packs and only getting like a, a berry, <laughs> it's pretty bad. Uh, you know what? And also, I, I had these packs off to the side of me before we dive into the Beyond Generations. These like My Hero Academia packs, I saw like this was like the villain League, League of Villains one. And um, I've watched some My Hero, uh, like I think the first two or three seasons. Uh, not, I think they're on like six season six or seven now. Um, and I opened the setup when it first came out, but uh, like maybe four packs total. So this will be like my first time opening it up and almost like since the release of the game uh, back in like I think 2021. Uh, we have Mastermind's Apprentice. And this is kind of like a mini halftime show. We have Muscle Molar. We have Ignite. League Invitation. Enamored. I also don't know all the names of the characters, just like uh, the main people at the moment. Um, we have Shigaraki, I think, right? And uh, I forgot who that guy is. I think that's Endeavor's son, if I'm not mistaken. Dobby? Dobby. Is it Dobby? Let me know. Um, don't know who that is. Oh, and there's our like foil card at the end. Which is just a regular rare. Okay. So I, I have no idea what the pull rates or uh, the rarity tiers are in this. If y'all do, feel free to share. I think like uh, XRs or URs are like the best cards, but I can't remember at this point. It's been like over a year since I've opened these cards. Uh, that's one for all, I believe. Uh, Ninja Turtle guy, call him Leonardo. Hack and Slash. Firestarter, Mast Menace, Earth Beast, uh, Carpool to Work. Uh, we have a Pump Up, Muscle Man, and a Rare Shigaraki. Okay. A couple rares, nothing too crazy. We still have three packs left. I remember also, uh, man, if y'all are around for the crazy pandemic hype stuff, like, uh, it was a heck of a time. Like, this card game released and, like, everybody was like, oh, yeah, well, My Hero Academia is going to be, like, the next big thing. Uh, I definitely bought, like, the first edition set. Um, but, like, I never bought anything else of My Hero Academia. I was like, you know what? I'm not really into that. Uh, it's cool to have, like, the first edition boxes of the first set, but it's just kind of chilling, sitting on my shelves. Uh, we have another rare. It's nothing crazy. Like, what are the hit rates looking like? I got these out of a booster box from my local LGS, so I know they're legit. It's just we have not hit. Let's see if we can change that here. We have, I mean, that art looks really cool. Like if there's a reverse foil of this, that'd be tight. Uh, GMA, we have one for all, or all for one, my bad. Yeah, all for one's a bad guy. Uh, there's Leonardo again. Uh, up close and personal, we have muscular. And another regular rare. What the? I mean, the foiling's cool, but just regular rares? So I'm assuming out of five packs, right? And I've had... I don't even remember how long I've had these packs. Probably like over a year now? Uh, but let's see. Th there's got to be a hit in here, right? Hack and Slash, Mass Menace. Ooh, that looks tight. I like the art style in this card. Nebulous Stare. Enamored. Shigaraki in Control. Okay, the next card should be our rare slash higher rarity card. And a re another regular rare. Unless I'm missing something. Huh? Eh? No. I guess not. Man, that... Talk about bad luck. Uh, that's all good. That was fun. Uh, I, I can definitely say I won't be opening any more of that. So that was a one and done treat for all of you out there. Um, I mean, there's so many other better card games like Fusion World right now. Oh boy, I'm, I'm excited. Like I've been playing the online client, um, trying to do uh, some content on the game. So if, uh, any other content creators that are out there want to play and make some content out of it, let me know and let's get stuff scheduled. We have a Hoi Aura. Nice Frieza art. Looks tight. We have a rare Janemba and 
a rare Beerus. I like I do like the fact that they added like two rares per uh, per pack, but uh, the like I know some people like the more subtle foiling, which definitely gives a nice throwback to like the older sets where you had that subtle foiling. Um, personally, I just like the shiny ones more. Uh, it just it looks tight, especially with some of the art, like right here, like some of that, uh, like Fighter's Ambition or uh, Wild Resurgence foiling would look really awesome here. And it's kind of hard to read. Um, we have Turles and, and the crew. And nice. We have our first SR, which is the Tapion and Trunks. you right there and if you all have opened this set let me know what you pulled uh i'm sure y'all have seen if if you wanted to see my uh beyond generations video but we pulled like i got so confused with like this set because bandai really changed things up with the pull rates and like uh the rarities uh i pulled a pack that had like the harutagon leader or uh, alt art leader slr um and i was like oh i guess we didn't get anything but it ended up being an slr which is like i think one in three boxes because i think each case comes with like two uh, like three or four slrs something like that we have a trunks and we have a weiss that looks tight i do like the foiling on this card that looks cool yeah in the right light it definitely looks good Next pack, we have an upset looking Tapion, Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta, Bulma, Beerus. They gotta give Beerus some more like art, like art styles because it's got like three main poses, like or a variation of three poses, which is like, why? The man has more poses. Uh, we have Clash of the Strongest Cumber. We have a Whis. Ooh, nice. That Broly looks pretty good. I, yeah, I like the I like this with the subtle foiling, but again, I think it would look better with the sparkle foil. And a regular rare Frieza. Last few packs of the opening. If you made it this far, appreciate you all. And uh, if you haven't subscribed already, uh, go ahead and do that. Hit the subscribe button. Also like the video. Check out my channel my store openmango.com and my ebay store just open mango we're gonna do some pretty big things on the channel like uh, i think i've i've already pub published like the yeah the the website is live video um so yeah make sure to check that out we're gonna do a box break in like the third week of may if you're interested it's gonna be a realm of the gods booster box for, I know most of my uh, viewers are Dragon Ball fans, so we'll do that. And uh, I'll um, I'll more than likely announce like the information about like more about it in the Discord first. So like whoever's in the Discord has like first dibs, and then post a video about it for anyone else who um, wants to get in if it's not already sold out. Um, we have a Sun Go on, Go Ten. Uh, Minosha, Gohan, Zarbon, Here's Awakening, Balsack, Herdegarn, and oh, let's go. Oh, that's sick. SPR, Go Tanks. So, you know what's funny? Like, I actually, like, when I opened the booster box to get these packs out, uh, this was the box topper. Let me see if I have, yeah, I have it right here. It was the box topper. That's hilarious. I'm going to put you right there. Also, where'd it go? Me? I, and I just had it. It's kind of hilarious. Like, you lost that? But I was trying to show... Oh, it's over there. I might grab it later. Let's continue on with the packs. But yeah, I was trying to show the uh, Zora Manga Rare I pulled. Channel that luck. We have a Piccolo. Ooh, that, that's some nice art on Vegeta. Looks pretty tight. 
Uh, we have Goten. You must die by my hands, Gohan. We have Tapion, uh, Gohan, Kakao, Whis, Aura, Piccolo Rare, and a Beerus Rare. Like that. Like that art. Last pack of the opening. Let's go. We have Sun Goku. Jodotba. Tapion. I think that's our first Janimba. Oh, that, that freeze art looks sick too. Tight. The Gohan. Beerus. See what I'm talking about? Like the pose with the orb. Come on, man. He needs more love than that. Spark and Kamehameha. That looks tight. We have Scheming Turtles, Crush Corpse, Hirudagon. We have Frieza and a regular rare Trunks. Well, not bad. I uh, did pull three hits or two hits, but one being an SPR, which it is, it is insane. Let's check it out without a sleeve. That's just like <laughs> the amount of foiling. Ridiculous. I really like that. Hard to read the card still, like especially like the names. Like I can't even read the name unless you like put it in a very like you have to angle it. Um, but yeah, it still looks really cool. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm just rambling at this point, but I appreciate you all for stick, sticking around, checking out the video. I hope you all have a great rest of y'all's day, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.